Welcome back to Filmblade. Today we're going to create this quick and easy logo intro inside DaVinci Resolve's Fusion. This is something you can create within a few minutes. It's that simple and yet hella dope. We're going to be doing some basic animation using DaVinci's powerful spline editor, text masking and some motion blur. And we'll be giving the project file for absolutely free. Download link in the description. This is going to be very exciting, so let's get started. So we're on our edit page and we imported our logo into our media pool. Let's head to our toolbox, go to effects and drop a fusion composition. Switch to fusion page, hit shift plus space for the select tool menu and type background. Hit it. Pipe it to media out. Drop in our logo from the media pool. Hit F2 to rename. Let's call it logo. Merge it by piping it to the background. Let's call it logo merge. Merge node is important, as we'll see later. Adjusting opacity is easier with merge. Oh, by the way, I'm on single viewer mode here. You can toggle viewing mode from here. With our logo node selected, drop a transform node. And let's start our animation. Let's say our animation shall end here at this frame. Keyframe this. With transform node selected, head to the inspector tab, size, and hit this diamond button to mark this keyframe. Now head to frame zero and shrink the size to zero. Here it is. Let's do the same to rotation as well. Keyframe the angle dial. Nice, but not enough. To really give this a professional edge, open spline. It will give us this powerful curve editor. Select the transform from here in this list and click on this zoom to fit icon and now you can see the movements plotted on a graph. If this is your first time on a curve editor, don't get overwhelmed, it's fairly simple. As you can see, pink is size and green is rotation. Click this vertex here. This is where the animation stops. And pull this handle such that it creates this easy ease here. Same with the first frame. And you can see how it smoothens up the size animation. Do this for rotation as well. Sweet. Do add some subtle opacity shift. With the merge node selected, keyframe the blend. And as always, smooth out the animation. And boy, does it look good. Why stop here? Make some room for text. Drop text node. Merge it by piping it to logo merge. Rename it. Type in your text. Adjust pacing and size. We're going to place it such that it will complement the movement of our logo. But before, add this rectangle mask. As you can see, it's an opacity mask. Select the frame with the text node selected. Head to the Inspector tab. Layout and keyframe the end position. Go a few frames back and keyframe the starting point. Smooth up the animation. Keyframe the opacity as well from the merge node, as per taste. Oh. 
Now just add the icing, add the motion blur. Set it to better, not faster. And maybe reduce the blur a bit. We kind of forget to smooth up the text opacity animation. Smooth AF. <laughs> Back to the edit page. It feels a bit off center. Let's add some keyframe on the zoom. And some on opacity to give it a fade off. And to really sell this logo intro, let's add some sound, for which we're going to use Pulsar Modern Cinematic SFX library, a library of more than 450 original high-quality compositions and sounds. Place it at the right moment. Since we are giving this project file for free, we want to show you how you can use it at your ease. You can just drop in a new logo, disconnect the old one and pipe in the new one with a transform node. To fix any size issues, drop in another transform node and just reduce the size. The rest of the animation will follow along as it is. Because the original animation stays intact, as it was done on the upper transform node. Change the text and boom! This is it! This is how we create an easy and quick logo intro inside DaVinci Resolve. Do not forget the free project file link in the description. Download it and go do your own thing with it. Make new stuff and share it with us. Shall love to see. If you are serious about leveling up your post-production game, Check out Pulsar Modern Cinematic SFX library in our high-end 16mm Pro 4K film grain pack, along with other premium assets at www.filmblade.com. Use the coupon code in the description to get 15% off. Limited time only. We've attached all the links in the description. Subscribe to level up your filmmaking game and follow us on Instagram at Filmblade to stay updated. That's it for now. Until next time.